Indiana's nicest day is on the calendar. The 52nd annual Penrod's Arts Fair is Saturday. It's at the Indiana Museum of Art or Newfields, and it is one of the largest single-day art fairs in the country. Today, I'm joined here in studio. Boy, I'm feeling very vertically challenged in here behind this piece of artwork. Okay, so what, who we have here today, we have Amy Carroll, who is an artist, and she's going to talk a little bit about what she's doing. And then we also have, from Penrod, we have Barry Wormser, who is the chairman this year. So, Amy, we're going to start with you sure. because you are a porcelain artist I am. and you, but you also have this great work here on canvas tell us a little bit about uh, your inspiration and how this is created so I'm always inspired by nature and I think flowers are one of the things that are just they speak across all cultures they're the <laughs> communication that reaches everywhere I'm painting on porcelain which is a little bit different but it's pretty much the same thing anything that stands still I'll paint on it uh -huh. but porcelain I'll have to fire it in many layers and today's the first fire of this vase and you'll see examples of also what I do with the porcelain on these as well all right well we'll let you just sure. uh, keep going at it there this will put be a pretty rose, little put a leaf on the on your beautiful rose there or, or the details mm -hmm. of your rose uh, what makes this event so special Barry oh, it's, it's countless things um, it's our artists it's our patrons it's our musicians it's our performers we really bring together a, a huge swath of the art and cultural community here in Indianapolis. And, and, you know, one of the things I think we're really trying to ensure that our patrons know is their support of the event through their ticket purchase really is driven right back into the community through our grant process. So it's, uh, it's a unique organization and a unique event. Yeah, and, and people don't realize that it's not just things to buy, but there are performances That's throughout right. the day and really great food, too. That's right. So we have uh, uh, many stages with really kind of any kind of performance you want. Mm -hmm. So if you're into... Uh, in the music, we're going to have musicians of every kind of uh, musical variety that you can think of. And, and then in addition to that, we're going to have uh, performances by, by some of the great organizations of, uh, that we have locally, like the Indianapolis Children's Choir and many others. So there's really something for, for everyone. I always love to see the ballet. I think it's so beautiful out there yeah. in the park. So tell us a little bit about the hours and the ticket prices and why you might want to plan early. That's right. So uh, the fair takes place from 9 to 5 p.m. Uh, if you buy your ticket now at penrod.org, you save $5 off of the uh, price of admission on the day of. So definitely is worth uh, planning early. You can find a whole host of information on the penrod.org website. And we're so thrilled. Uh, this is our 52nd annual Somerset CPAs and Advisors Penrod Arts Fair. So it's going to be a, an incredible year. Yes, and so it's $15 in advance or $20 day of. And there is an event on Friday night. That's that right. You can we have about. our more formal event, Evening with Penrod. We welcome all of uh, the patrons uh, uh, who come to Friday night back on Saturday. You get a free ticket to the uh, Penrod Arts Fair if you go to Evening with Penrod. Yeah, it's a great event. Yeah, Thanks thank for you. coming yeah, and letting absolutely. people know about it. If you're new to our community, you want to check it out. Thanks so much. Thank and what booth number are you at, Amy? I'm 009, right in the Stutz Village. All right. And this beautiful painting was $350, right? So if you're interested in that, you can come pick it up. But come early because I'm sure it's going to go fast. <laughs>